Hello, welcome back to another tutorial video. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to record and add audio in PowerPoint to your presentations. So, first things first, make sure you have opened up PowerPoint and you have your desired presentation that you want to record and add the audio to. And then what we're going to want to do uh, is we're gonna to want to go over to the Insert tab. So you have the File, Home, and then Insert. So go to the Insert tab here. And then we have something on the far right that says Video, Audio, and then Screen Recording. If we go to Audio, hit the drop-down menu, we have two different options here. So we can add it from a pre-existing recording already on our PC by going to Audio on my PC, locating that MP3 or WAV file or whatever audio file you have, and then go to Insert, and that will insert that way. But most of you are wanting to know how to record. If you hit the drop-down menu here, you can see we have an option that has Record Audio. If we select Record Audio, we will have this dialog box presented to us here. But before we do that, I want to give you something. Make sure you check your audio settings. And in order to do that, you need to make sure you have an audio recording device, a microphone, a sound interface, whatever, an audio interface, whatever you're using. So go hover over the volume or the speaker icon here in the lower right hand corner of your PC here on your taskbar. Right click on that and then go to open sound settings. Now we obviously could have gone into control panel, search for sound settings and navigated that way, but that's just an easier way of getting there. Go to where you see input, which is right here. Don't worry about the speakers or any of that. Go to input, make sure that your desired microphone that you're wanting to use is selected. Now I'm recording audio for this tutorial on a different uh, computer on a different PC. Uh, and so it's not going to come up as well, but as I get this microphone closer to my mouth, you can see that it continues to go up and you can see uh, how good the microphone is picking up right here as you see it going left to right here. So make sure you have your audio devices set up. Go back to your uh, PowerPoint presentation and then all you have to do uh, is hit the record button. But before you do, you can even name that so you can give a name to your recorded sound. So give it a name and then when you're ready to go, hit the red record button here. And then as uh, you go here, as you're recording, it'll say total sound length and then it'll count up, uh, letting you know how long this audio file or audio clip that you're going to add is in case you have a specific time frame that you're trying to kind of stay within. And then when you're done recording the audio clip, hit the red square icon there. And then as you can see, total sound length is 21. When you hit the record button again, that will re-record over what you just recorded. When you're satisfied, hit OK. And then as you can see, you have the nice little audio icon come available to you that you can click and hold and drag anywhere on your presentation like you would any other element. You can make this bigger, you can make this smaller, and then obviously you can right click and adjust it like you normally would. You can change the picture, change the color, all of that good stuff. But as far as that goes, you're good to go now. You can see here, we can just press the play button to play it back button here and then as now as you can see that audio is being played back here I can adjust the volume by dragging the slider down or up if that's something that I want to do I can pause and then when I'm playing back this slideshow so if I go to slideshow and then go to from beginning you see now in my presentation I have the audio icon here and then if I just press the space bar or whatever I have set to trigger my animations whether it be a clicker or whatever it is I go ahead and do that now and the audio as you can see as I hover over it begins to play and it lets me know how far along it is by the timeline below the audio there and then when it's done playing it'll just stop and then you can hit space again to move on to the next part of your presentation. So that's how you record and add audio within PowerPoint. If you have any questions about how to do this, please put those in the comment section down below. If this helps you out, don't forget to help me out by liking, sharing, and subscribing to the channel for more great technology tutorials and how-to guides just like this. And I will see you guys in the next video.